Hey, Summit, this is Edward. You know this guy, Jake. This is your weekly update. Make sure you share this on all your platforms. Get the word out. We're coming into the fall season. Where's I your think. shirt? I didn't wear my shirt. Nope. Thought I, we I thought we were supposed to, weren't we? Thought we was wearing our shirts today. I, is that kind of the new uniform? Hey, is thanks for the cup of coffee, but I don't know if you guys can see this or not. It poured me a cup of coffee this morning, only up to here. Hey, but th that's the Keurig. I didn't pour it. The Keurig made it. That's how that works. Hey, we got some cool things happening at Summit Heights Fellowship that you need to be aware of. What do we got, Edward? Well, you know, Wednesday nights, uh, youth ministry had an incredible night last night. If you missed last Laser night. Laser tag. Holy cow. Man, did you see the pictures of those? You know, oh, I, would, I, I went up Were there. You there? Oh, I mean, I gosh. wasn't there for the whole thing, but I went up there, and there, they was running all through the building, tearing stuff Dude, up. it was crazy. The kids everywhere. But also, starting this coming Wednesday night, our children's ministry is kicking off. Uh, their, their program, all Wednesday nights groups, kindergarten through second grade is coming up this Wednesday night. Ashley had a leadership meeting last night. We're excited about that. So if you have a kindergarten through second grade, get them there next Wednesday night, six o'clock. Uh, it's going to be a great time. If you know somebody in our community that has kids that age, bring them with you. There is uh, a massive it's gonna be dog over there. Yeah, it's, it looks like a horse. His name is I Whiskey. thought it was a horse. His name is Whiskey. That is a massive yeah. dog. It's it's a it's one of those big yeah. uh, poodles. Uh, I mean, his paws are yeah. in right. Hey, Wednesday night. Children's ministry. Of also, course. this Sunday, Jake, you remember last spring when at the end of the service we would break down that middle yep. section and set up tables? For youth ministry? Okay, that starts this Sunday. So uh, at the end of the service this Sunday, we're going to break that middle section down for our student ministry. Cool thing about Summit Heights, if you're new to Summit, we use every part of our building for all of our ministries. No one area uh, is capitalized by one. We use it all. I mean, we use everything across that building. So this Wednesday uh, or this Sunday, we'll prepare for the Wednesday night service at the end of the service. Also, Jake, you know what opens up today, don't you? Uh, your office for a nap. Talk no. about using every part of the building. I love it on Thursdays. You study from home and I get to use your office for my afternoon nap. Not exactly, but you know, I'm really surprised you don't know because today is opening registration for the youth ministry golf tournament. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Scramble. So October yeah. the yeah. 8th, we're going to be doing four man teams. Four man teams. You can register starting, I think, this afternoon. Let's is what do David it. Said. Let's get it. I know he's at the office right now working on it, getting yeah. it ready, fixing the launch. Put your four man team together. We're going to send tons of kids to camp, mission trips, all the yeah. stuff they do. Uh, listen, we baptized 13 over the last two weeks. Yeah. And that's all because of events like this and your generosity and what you guys do. I'm telling you. I'm thinking gonna, we should, for this scramble, give the teams an opportunity to buy a Jesus Walked on Water ticket. And if you hit your ball in the pond, you, 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 get, to, you get to hit another ball and it doesn't count actually, against you. It's actually a really yeah, good idea. Raise some more money that way. Yeah, that's really I told you golf was idea. scriptural. Yeah, you just don't, you never believe yeah, it. It's not. Hey, right. who all got plugged into a group this week? I've been sending emails and making phone calls. Hey, I got a group. Getting, people have been getting back to up. me. I've plugged in people to women's groups and our Sunday after church groups. Uh, I'll have all the group's cards at the info desk. You still have time to get plugged into a group. Want to make a, a real shameless plug about the new group. That's going to be starting on Sundays after church, starting September the 11th. We'll meet three Sundays a month, myself, and then Kate and Amos uh, Brown, and then Kenneth and Mary Sperlin will be leading uh, that. So awesome. Already have like six couples signed up for that. We've got plenty of room. So if you want to be a part of that, if you want to be a part of any other group, come see me at the info desk either before or after church. Not during church. We want to respect Edward's time while he's preaching. But, you know. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And also, you can still serve. Uh, All-in cards are at the uh, yeah. information desk. I know that our preschool area is looking for some volunteers. That requires a background check. Preschool area is a little low on volunteers, kind of like my coffee. Ever I, me this I'm way. telling you straight up, man, last week they were busting at the seams back there. Oh, with and, kids, yeah. Yeah, so the great way I'm not, for you to Hey, serve. this is seriously not – we're not exaggerating. We had over 100, 100 kids when you combine the preschool and the kid venture last Sunday. That's a, lot of, that's a lot of kids. 100. 
100. 100. That's 100. a lot of kids, and we need volunteers to love on them. Listen, our primary purpose in kids' ministry is we want kids to know that God created them, God yeah. loves them, and God has a plan for their life. So we need you back there. That's actually not a bad thing for adults to know either. So, uh, Well, that is true. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you know, where we live in. What else we got, dude? Well, it looks like I'm going to have to be buying me another cup of coffee when I leave here. Well. Hey, we're excited to uh, meet with a guy today about Baptism Sunday. we got more baptisms like the following it. Sunday. I if like you it. have not been baptized, or you don't even know what that means, uh, yeah. man, get with us. We'd love to Or if you got gospel. baptized and you dried off and you need to do it again. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. Well, that, I would qualify being baptized now. I'm dripping sweat. 93% humidity. And I'm feeling it in my back right now. I, I, dude, I'm, I'm telling you, it's dripping off my elbows. Right I can't now. imagine what that horse dog over there with all that hair is feeling. That, that's a standard poodle. That thing is a whiskey. It's a hey, when we mow dog. over there on that fence, he'll come massive running right behind you dog. and stomp his foot. Dude, massive it's like a horse. Some of we love you. Uh, seriously, back on the baptism thing, if you want to uh, follow through the baptism, uh, we'd love to talk to you. Maybe you got say, maybe you prayed to receive Christ a couple of weeks ago in our service, or maybe this last week. Um, we'd love to visit with you. Or maybe so, right now during this video. Yeah, connect with us. We, we would love to talk to you. By the way, I'm also going to be um, bringing something new uh, next week in our uh, update video. So uh, nice. I'm just going to kind of tease that out. And, I may not and, show up uh, then. It's, it's going to be good. Hey, we love you. 10 o'clock, Sunday morning. Summer Hats Fellowship. If you can't join us in person, join us online. Uh, get some people to watch with you. Uh, if you're watching on a broadcast during the week, thank you for watching. We love you. Can't wait to see you Sunday, Jake. I'm going to move forward now, and I'm going to turn the camera off because we don't have a remote.